Hello and welcome to my new series where we are going to do a, we're going to do best two out of threes with every deck in Duel Monsters. I am with my good pal Dilly Dilly, aka Dilly Few More. How you doing, buddy? Yo, what up? This is Wilbur Flip Hubba Flip the third of the queue is silent, no relation, but you can call me Dylan. Yeah. So with that said, let me run down the rules real quick. The long and short of it is, we're gonna be playing best two out of three. We're gonna start off. We're gonna be playing. In this case, since it's Duel's Kingdom, we're gonna be playing two thousand life points. And of course, I'm gonna be playing Yugi's deck while Dilly plays Kaiba's deck. So and whoever say, loses the most has to shape off their eyebrows. Let's do this. No, that is not a rule. <laughs> Fuck! I already got Amari on disadvantage here. Okay, let's see. Right. Ooh. Let's see. I forgot how shit Yugi's deck is. Dude, I don't fucking know how to use any of this shit. Okay, well, Literally. I'm gonna start off with summoning Guy of the Fierce Knight. Oh, that's right, we're doing the Duelist Kingdom rules, thank god. You okay. already forgot. I No, because I forgot that, the, the, like, you know, there's the built-in setting so that we can summon the, you know, higher level monsters. I forgot about that. Yeah. I would have been hysterical after you immediately summoned Blue Eyes White Dragon or something. Yo, dude, could you fucking imagine? <laughs> Alright, I draw- I saw Blue Eyes White Dragon. Yo, what? <laughs> Gaia, attack! You- Oh my- Oh, well, I'm fucked. I'm dead. Let's go! Oh, wow, ironic. We both drew our ace cards. Yo, what the fuck? <laughs> Yo! Okay. Alrighty! Place two. Oh yeah, that was the other thing. Oh, oh, Jesus! My life points are already at 150. <laughs> Cyberchar is OP! Cyberchar is so OP in this in this format. Hmm. What do I want to summon? <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Yeah, we're trying to figure out and see if the uh, results that happen in this game in the anime were actually meant to happen, else spellbinding circles. Oh, Screw your you, blue eyes, you don't get to attack me. You fucking fuck fuck. Hmm. Also, fun fact, all the decks we are using are built by me. I basically spent lots of time and effort on these. Yeah, good Some thing you more than life. others. I'm just gonna end it there. Ooh, which ones do I get rid of? Which ones do I get rid of? Uh, I guess that. Hey. I'm not gonna use that yet. So we have a minor problem at the moment. I'm afraid to play this because if I do and it's and you have something down there that can stop me, I'm probably gonna die. But uh, I'm going to summon a dark magician since you summon out your blue eyes white dragon. <clears throat> Bruh. I might bring magic formula. Uh, oh! I miscalculated that. I thought it was going to like, bring up a few points. Oh, well, that works too. Dark magic attack! Not cat. Your mighty legendary dragon has been destroyed and you'll pay for tearing my grandpa's card in half. Nerd. <laughs> Rich boy. <laughs> Please no. I don't trust that card, but I can't attack. Too bad. Oh, that's my magical hats. <laughs> I don't know if I do it. You know what? Screw the rules. My dark magician. Oh boy. Uh. 
this is um this is quite the predicament here. Oh boy. So you want to know something funny? What? I have both the ritual monsters that I run in this deck in my hand, but Seriously? I have neither Seriously? the ritual spells. I do. I have both Blackluster Soldier and Magician by Chaos. Have neither of the ritual spells in this deck. Hmm. Okay, so well, no, I have them in the deck, on. I haven't drawn them yet. Do you know why I cannot summon my level 6 monster without tributing, even though we're doing Duelist Kingdom rules? No, you can, you can. If you click on it, just say, if, if the prompt comes up, just cl click the check mark. It should, it should let uh, you. Oh, okay. Yeah, if it prompts you, just ignore it. Okay, okay, got it. Thank you, thank you. Can you maybe not attack me? I kind of, I kind of need those. Mm, uh, I'm gonna. Why can't I attack at the other one? Oh okay. yeah, you, in oh. Duel's Kingdom you can only attack once per turn. Really? Yeah, you didn't know that. Huh. <clears throat> no, why, I didn't know why, that. Why, yeah, no, that's why none of them really attacked more than once. Dude, I swear, like in the anime, we will attack once three times in one turn. Okay, it's <laughs> okay. No, that was because of Great Moth. That was because Great Moth just. I, I'm could. just saying, like, the rules in the, in the anime are not very consistent. Okay, well, to be fair, we're talking about the fucking show where almost every other episode, Flame Sword went from being a fusion to a normal monster and back and forth. Constantly. Yeah, that's true. Hey, it's my favorite monster. Luis! <laughs> Wait, what? That is my favorite fun fact. In the Japanese, you know, like the original Japanese card, Beaver Warrior is Luis. Oh my god. His name yeah, is not I even like it's about not, that. Dude. And also, let's not forget the fact he's not even a beaver, he's a rat. Look at his tail. Oh, yeah, you're right. But that's just the point. Like in the anime, they literally say he literally says like I summon Luis. His name it's just straight up Luis. <laughs> oh god, that's fantastic. <laughs> I'm noticing a theme here with Yugi's deck. Kind of annoyed that you killed my own, like two of my immediately only good beaters in this deck. <laughs> Just gonna set this face down and end my turn. Hmm. What should I do? It's definitely not mirror force. It's definitely not mirror force, right? You're right. That was not Mirror Force. You've no idea how much I wish it was Mirror Force. I have an idea. What is your idea? A lot. Oh, God. Hope you win. Oh, oh boy. <laughs> so, there's one other rule you should realize. God damn it. If I can't summon a monster, uh, you, you straight up lose. Every <laughs> rule. <laughs> Game one nice. goes to Kaiba. Woo! Right. Round one win. Let's see if I can get round two secured. All right, I'll let you go first this time. Cause frankly, I need all the raw power I can get. Ooh! Ho! 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 You know what? You know what? I am my turn. Okay. I summon Kamori Dragon in attack mode. Did you win? Then I attack your oh. face down. No, don't. How dare you? <laughs> I set. Some cards face down. I'm not gonna say what those cards are, but I'm ending my turn. <laughs> I summon Hatsume Giant. I, I not Hatsume. 
Hatsumi <laughs> Giant. I summon Hatsume Miku in attack mode. Oh my god. Fuck. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you can't attack directly. Ah, uh, right. Right, right, right. Yeah, it looks right. like I have finally drawn a card that can swing into your monster. Go! Curse of Dragon! Mama! No! Your mighty Hitatsumi Giant falls. That isn't Cyber Jar now, is it? No! <laughs> that isn't Cyber Jar, is it? You only know if you attack! I kind of find out if it's Cyber Jar. Oh. I'm not! <laughs> I'm genuinely paranoid because Kaiba's deck is so <laughs> powerful because of the fact that it has Cyber Jar in it. And because forget of the fact that it's Cyber Jar, I'm terrified of some more than one monster. Fucking forget Blue Eyes. Cyber Jar is the real menace <laughs> exactly. here. Exactly. Because with Blue Eyes, I could just stall him out with with as many defenses as possible. You know, Cyber I find Jar, it interesting. You, you, get, you have a built field, you're just dead immediately. I find it interesting that you keep attacking the face down defense monsters with a chance of it being Cyber Jar, then the face up defense one. I just remembered it has a, an effect that'll fuck you up. Never mind. No wonder you keep attacking them. Yeah, no, I I thought it was a flip effect at first when I read it, and I was like, yeah, no, not doing that. I would like my <laughs> Curse of Dragon on the field very much. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh boy, I don't know what to do. Uh, well, you know what? Oh, I have a second powerful monster now. Rude Kaiser. Oh no. And I'll power him with the mystical moon. I attack the moon! I'm attacking the moon! Damn. What are the odds you can't summon a monster? I didn't want to summon these yet, but fuck it. No. Okay then. And also because it didn't count as a normal summon, I think I win. I don't know. Yep. The ultimate counter to Blue Eyes. A goddamn horn with wings. I don't like this rule. I don't like this rule. <laughs> <laughs> it's such a gamble. Wait, so if I don't normal summon, I lose? Yeah, basically. Or well, no. If you don't, if you don't, if you have an empty field and you didn't normal summon, then you okay. lose. Okay. If you just if you had a monster on the field before, and then it was just destroyed, then you're fine. I mean. Earlier in the game, you like the first couple of turns, you just set a couple cards face down. You didn't summon any monsters. How come you didn't lose then? No, I'm pretty sure I summoned something. No, I did. Okay. It was just that I attacked the face down. Your your wall evolution sent it back to my hand. Ah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You're right. You are right. You know what they're wrong with this? I've yet to draw a single Exodia piece, and Exodia is in this deck. No, I just fucking remember that. Oh god! Yeah, I know. That's the hilarious thing. I have not oh, drawn no. a single piece of Exodia this entire duel. <laughs> I guess that goes to show that Yugi doesn't need Exodia to win. Hey, wait a second. He didn't have Exodia during Duelist Kingdom. He had it during the first episode. But that wasn't during Duelist Kingdom. <laughs> Uh Spell Blinding Circle! Shush! <laughs> you fucking cheater. <laughs> to be fair, I'm, Exodia is only in this in this first duel. I didn't take Exodia out by chance, did I? Because I might have done that by accident. Mm. 
I sacrifice my monster to summon <gasps> this defense mode. Attack it, I dare okay, you. Okay. I double dare you, just, motherfucker. Can Attack we just pause me. for a second? Can we just pause for a second? Look at Grappler. What the fuck is this card? This is the most terrifying picture. And the name. The name makes me so uncomfortable. A devious snake with a thick body that wraps around an enemy monster and squeezes the life out of it. It looks like a goddamn sex offender. Wow. Look at it. He looks like he's not allowed within a certain number of miles of a preschool. Anyway, I set him on the fence, but it hit my turn. <laughs> it's just like we were just talking about this randomly, and just like, oh yeah, by the way, I forgot to do this. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot we were playing a children's card game. Yeah, yeah. Um, it was also weird looking at Rude Kaiser and Grabbler and just noticing how different the art style is. Yeah. With someone sang in an attack mode to have my turtle explode. <laughs> you know. uh, oh. And yep, I was right. I forgot to put Exodia back in the deck because I was playing with it earlier. <sighs> hmm. You gonna attack? Uh, I'm gonna add John Soldier's Stone to my hand. Oh. Uh, yes, now you're gonna attack? Ability. No. <laughs> Why not? I don't want to fight whatever potential cyber jar that is face down. Not cyber jar. It's fine, my turtle did what it needed to do. It served its purpose. <laughs> Set another monster in defense mode and end my turn. And I also realize I have a, a very comedic setup right now that I can do for the funnies. Should I do it next turn? You goofy. Hmm. Fuck you. No, my stone soldier. I like them. I'm actually not joking when I say that, by the way. I actually really like Giant Soldier of Stone. I don't know why, I just I love the design of it. Silver Fang attack. Damn it. Oh god, I keep forgetting we're playing on 2,000 life points. Oh. Yes. Can we talk about this? So apparently I can't attack with him when I summon him. <laughs> Good to know. Anyway. <clears throat> Swing into the legend. Can we talk about this? <laughs> I mean, we did technically talk about it. I didn't attack the Ancient Lamp, which was a much better target for this. That is true. I will not. So technically, that. I talked about it. I was reasonable. So technically, shut up. I'm not feeling too good about this one. I'm gonna summon a Torek. The fuck is that? I'm gonna finally destroy Root Kaiser. No. How dare you? Oh wait, I just realized I can use one. I I find it funny because I have two cards in my hand that I can use on your monsters. It would have no benefit for me. <laughs> okay, but why though? Mm. Oh, fun. So I'm curse of dragon in attack mode. Not fun. Not not fun at all. 
Oh, and I can't attack twice. Nah, I don't like that I can't attack twice. I like it. I like it a lot. <laughs> of course you like <clears throat> You're on the back foot right now. This is what I had to deal with the previous, like, in one of the previous duels. Ooh, that would be good for later, if I think so. so. Uh, anyway, though. Curse of Dragon! Destroy the clown! Because I'm terrified if you draw a Crush Card Virus, because that will absolutely obliterate my deck. <laughs> Which I know is in that deck. I put it in there specifically. Clown hater. Do you got anything good in there? No, you don't. Do I got anything good in here? No, I don't. No, you don't. <laughs> Wait. <coughs> oh, I win. What? I activate Monster Reborn. What? And no. Catapult Turtle. <laughs> and oh. sacrifice Curse of Dragon to deal a thousand points oh. of damage. Okay. Well, I'm not as sour as I would have been if you summoned fucking Blue Eyes White Dragon. No, you didn't have, if you had Pleasant White Dragon in there, I would have actually been hysterical as I did that. I just realized, though, how did I forget to put Exodia back in? Hang on a minute, I need to see something. <laughs> did I just straight up forget to put it in here? Oh, Richard. What? Um, I'm more than halfway to getting monetized on YouTube. Oh, congratulations. And yes, I did. Would you like to do one more duel where I actually have the pieces of Exodia in here? Yeah, sure, why not? Well, I got the time. Yeah, you guys are getting a bonus duel because we completely didn't realize that Exodia wasn't in the deck. Yo, can you imagine forgetting to put a card in the deck you're using? Like, how stupid can you be? No, imagine losing twice to the deck that was supposedly gonna have that as a saving yo, grace. Yo, no, no, Richard, imagine, right, this is a crazy scenario, but just imagine it, right? Imagine you and your friend agreeing not to kill each other in a duel so you can both summon your best monsters, only to realize at the end of the duel you forgot to put one of those monsters in the deck. <laughs> How crazy really? would that be if that happened? How crazy that would that crazy. be? Can we talk about this? Uh, sure. We talked about it. No, we didn't! Yeah, I said sure. I was talking about it. <clears throat> Maybe I shouldn't have immediately summoned the summon skull. <laughs> I have a bit of a trigger finger, if you couldn't tell. Because the funny thing is, I now have a card in my hand that would have been fantastic to play immediately. Oh no. <laughs> you don't have all three in your hand, do you? Huh? Do you have the third in your hand? What? <laughs> do you no? or do you not? I guess you'll hand? find out. <clears throat> What's the opposite of bricking? Um, me basically losing my one win condition with this deck. Yeah, let's I say feel that like happened. The Exodia piece just gave me massive bad luck because of this fact. <laughs> oh, I don't know if I want to use this. One. <clears throat> oh, this is getting worse for me. Oh no, buddy! <clears throat> Take my hand. No, no. I find it funny because one of the cards I have in this deck is a card they use against the Paradox Brothers, and it makes no sense in game, and it makes no sense now. Oh no, Luis! <laughs> How could you kill Luis, you monster? <laughs> you know, I'd really like to draw a polymerization and third blue eyes. You have the third blue eyes in hand, don't you? I don't know. Wow. This is a uh, quite predicament here. Yeah, you really love that saying, don't you? 
It really, I really do. I drew a Zodia. Oh. Yay. Oh. No. No. Yes. I no. saw the Dork Magician. No, 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 and then no, no. The Horn of the Unicorn. No. Dark Magician. Dark Magician. If you do this, Magical you'll Dark regret it. You're, okay, you're gonna regret it. You are. <coughs> <laughs> what did you get? <laughs> what could you possibly? <laughs> the. What? Oh, I was gonna say I was so confused for a minute. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> <clears throat> I could, I could like, I could hear like the confusion. Like, what did you? <laughs> Why the fuck would you do that? Oh god! I have no, I, I, I have to normal summon catapult turtle in attack mode. Oh, I'm dead. Oh yeah, you are. Yeah, no, it didn't matter what I did. I was dead next turn. Yay. <laughs> so one more because it's now <clears throat> two to two. <sighs> Final round, guys. You got an extra bonus of two duels. Here we go. Okay, I learned from my mistake. I'm not gonna sum my best cards right away and possibly kill myself. <laughs> like an idiot. Ooh, oh, uh, mm, yeah, 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 I'm doing this. That one. That one. And the fucking. That thing. Oh my god, you got oh. rid of Grappler? How could you? Your favorite card. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, I got... Not doing too good right now, man. I'm just gonna attack your face down in preparation. Of yep, I called it! I knew it! I really wish you summoned a good monster now. That's, that's why I waited. I purposely waited because I knew you were gonna do it. I, I saw Luis. Luis! And Bring my boy out! Yeah, there's my boy! <laughs> so stupid. It really is, but it's, also, it's pretty funny at the same time, you gotta admit. I'm gonna set one card face down and end my turn. Ooh, boy, and it is done. It's yeah. over, you cannot surpass Luis. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> boy. Oh, ooh, ooh, do I, oh, I don't know. I, if I ooh. ever, if, if I get this video and this, this whole series to about, to at least a million views, I will do an entire challenge of me doing every duel with Beaver Warrior as my headliner. <laughs> See what happens. <laughs> what is this doing? I don't know. Oh, I made you attack this instead. Uh, fucking me over, that's what that's doing. Hey, we have the same life points now. Hey, fuck off. I'm, I'm, I'm probably gonna decline on that offer. Oh, shut the fuck up. Mm, nah. Bitch. Oh, wow, this is kind of poetic to see this. You remember this combination? Feral Limp with Horn, Horn of the Unicorn, the actual oh, way to be used. No. When they made, like, when an era Horn of the Unicorn was equipped, Feral looks, like, so much more terrifying to look at. Hmm. Hmm. You see, you're uh, really struggling there, aren't you? Well, now we have to go again, because you tied it! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> final, final, final round. We <laughs> uh, Oh, oh boy. 
Oh God's uh-huh. head is yeah. dookie. Oh fuck me. Okay. Dookie of the highest caliber. Someone tore <laughs> attack position. And then I attack your face dead. Do you? Are you sure? Fuck. <laughs> In just in case something goes wrong and I absolutely am going to die. Eeny, meeny, money mo. Touch a tiger by the toe. If he hollers, let him go. Eeny, meeny, money mo. My mother says you picked up best one and that is you. I activate the spellbinding circle. He looks to die in a second. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Fuck it. Hey, guess what? You chose wrong. Oh, you donkey ball sucker. The fuck? I don't fucking know. Some roof hazard attack mode. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. So going forward, I can assure you guys that this, this duel is these duels are not gonna be there's not gonna be five duels back to back. I don't know. Six duels actually because we're because the last one tied. Is that Cyberjar? No. How would you think of that? <clears throat> I'm gonna attack him. They didn't have a face down. You destroyed my other one. Ooh. Give me something good. Yeah, yeah, that's that's pretty. Oh, oh, what one do I do? You get oh, something boy. good. Yeah, yeah, you can say that. What'd you get? Yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it is. Oh, that's unfortunate. So, you want to know one of the many dead cards in my hand currently? Hmm? I had brain control. Oh, oh, yep, that's yep, that's fair. Uh, that's I had brain control. <laughs> yeah. So in a long line of duels, it looks like Hybo won, which honestly makes sense because unlike Yugi's deck, Hybo's deck has a little bit of strategy to it because it has straight up beaters consistently. But uh, yeah. That concludes round the first the first episode of the would you win something question mark? Yes. You're really gonna have to work on this title, man. Like I'm it's gonna not really working. Gonna work on it, I know. But anyway, uh, question real quick. I yes. just wonder why did we set it to single when we could have done match, which is already two out of three. I don't know. Awesome. Don't worry about it. We'll just do it next time. In the next episode, where it's Yugi versus Weevil. Bye. Have a beautiful time. Have a good night, everyone.